When it comes to farms, they are one of the most important resources in the world. Even if you don't live close to one, you absolutely do reap the benefits of them. They provide you with food, they sometimes raise animals that you interact with, and more. They're what helps to keep the world running, and sometimes the farms that they have are massive in size. To that end, with their huge size and various amounts of times that they've been around, it's not unheard of that sometimes something odd is dug up on one of their properties. Join us as we show you 20 terrifying things found in farms. Number 20. Mammoth Skeleton a farmer discovered something weird outside his farm fields is honestly a near-perfect way to start almost every topic on this list. After all, the entire point of this video is to highlight the sometimes odd and freaky things that people have discovered on farmlands. But in this case, back in 2015, in Michigan of all places, a farmer was doing some work on his land when he came across something he truly could not identify. He at first thought that it was nothing more than an old bent post that had gotten really stuck in the mud, but the truth of that was much more shocking. For when he dug it out, he found himself looking at the pelvis bone of a woolly mammoth that had been in the ground for about 15,000 years. Due to that find, some experts came in and they were immediately able to get about 20% of the mammoth's body out of the ground. Aside from the pelvis, they also found the skull, two tusks, along with numerous vertebrae, ribs, and both of the shoulder blades. Actually, part of the other shoulder blade too, one kneecap. Some of this may be shocking to you because you likely didn't know that things like mammoths and mastodons roamed North America during the last ice age, but they did in fact do that. And within Michigan alone, they have found hundreds of partial remains of those creatures. But think of this from the farmer's perspective. He was just doing his thing and then found an ancient creature lurking right beneath his feet. That definitely would have delivered a shock, especially since it was there for over 10,000 years and no one had come across it until he tended to his field. The other thing that stood out about this skeleton is that it was much more complete than any previous ones that had been discovered in the state. They could even tell that the woolly mammoth had likely been hunted by humans and then chopped up so that its meat could be stored for later. But I'm also pretty sure that the intention was not for it to be that much later. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now it's time for the fancy topic. As you've just seen, you can find something that you're truly not suspecting on your farmland, if you're lucky enough to do so. But in the case of this alleged picture, you'd have to be a rather unlucky person to find this creature on your land. According to the story that circulates with the picture, a man would be roaming his farmland when he stumbled across this monstrous sight. The only thing that he could think to do was to run away after taking the picture, of course, and then after he calmed down, he went back to the location that the monster had been spotted in, and it was gone. Cue the spooky music, because we have a monster mystery on our hands. Jinkies! Or, more than likely, this picture isn't telling the whole story. No doubt something you noticed in the picture is that this supposed monster looks awfully human in a lot of ways, and even has clothes on like a jacket. Now sure, while its right arm looks more monstrous than the left, it's also a much more blurred part of the picture, and it leaves you wondering if part of this was edited. Another possibility here is that the picture is nothing more than a snapshot from a movie. After all, people have turned into monsters plenty of times on film and in television shows, so perhaps this is just one of them being used as a true story on the internet. And if you think otherwise, by all means let me know. It should be said that things definitely do not seem as they appear, and that's why you have to be ever vigilant when it comes to what you read on the internet. As always, let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below using the hashtag FancyTopic. Number 19. The Hourglass Spider I'm going to be very upfront with you right now. I take absolutely no pleasure in talking about this next topic because it has a spider in it, and spiders are terrible. 
They might be a key part of the ecosystem, but that doesn't mean that they don't suck, and this story further highlights why we should fear them, because this one looks particularly freaky. A person was tending to his farm when he found an arachnid. At first, the farmer did not realize that it was a spider, but instead thought that it was actually a cultural relic. After researching his find on the internet, he then discovered that it was a Chinese hourglass spider. But why does that matter? Well, it's because it's an incredibly rare spider that not many people knew about, including yourself. You probably didn't even know that this spider existed before coming to watch the video. Another reason that they're so rare is that they're trap door spiders, and thus they live underground where most people are not going to notice them unless they accidentally step on the homes of the spiders that they've made. They feed on bugs that pass their burrows, and whenever there's danger, they'll protect themselves by blocking the entrance of their nest using their stamp. That's the other freaky thing about this spider. When you look at it from above, you can see the hourglass shape via their backside. However, if you look at the back of the spider, it has a stamp-like look that bears markings that scientists are honestly baffled by. As for what happened with the spider the Chinese man found, he said that he was going to sell it as a pet for a good price. That shows that, despite what the man endured, he was able to keep his wits about him and make a profit. Isn't that the way of the world, though? Number 18. $600 million. Now, believe it or not, there have been numerous treasures, both big and small, that have been found by farmers on their properties. Most times, it's the kind of treasure that history buffs love because they're trinkets or coins or some other such collectible that can be easily placed in a museum. But in this case, it becomes a little bit different. Because in Colombia, a farmer would be granted permission to do some digging on his land, and when he did, he struck a barrel. Sometimes that would imply that a body was inside, but that was not the case in this instance, because not unlike an episode of Breaking Bad, there was money in that barrel. But not just any money, it was money that allegedly tallied to be $600 million. Can you imagine just digging on your land and then finding that kind of cash? That's life-changing in the biggest of ways, or at least it would be if the source had been more reputable. You see, the barrel allegedly belonged to the one and only Pablo Escobar, the legendary kingpin that had money out the wazoo, and I mean that almost literally, as he had so much cash that he would intentionally bury the treasure in secret places all over Colombia, and technically all over the world. So, the idea of him burying it on farmland in a barrel is not so far-fetched as you would think. Because of the owner of this money, the Colombian government seized it and claimed that they would use it to help benefit the nation. Whether that's true or not is heavily debated, but it wouldn't be the first time that a government had played fast and loose with something that was connected to Pablo Escobar. But seriously, could you imagine finding that money nearby? What would you do with all of that cash? Let me know all about it in the comments section down below. Number 17. Ice Age Animal Shells the Ice Age is one of the most important events of our world's recent times. 10,000 plus years may not seem like a recent time to some of you, but when you factor in how long the world has possibly been around, you're going to see that it's pretty much a drop in the bucket of what is our planet's timeline. The point is that if there are artifacts to be found from the Ice Age, they're going to be revered as they can tell us more about what life was like back then and how we've evolved from it, or more specifically, how animals have evolved from it. For example, example, a farmer in Argentina would uncover the preserved shells of four giant ancient armadillo creatures that roamed the earth around 20,000 years ago. The shells themselves were found in a dried out riverbed, and once discovered, officials came in to study the shells and more about them. What really made things special for those paleontologists was that these were not four random shells of ancient armadillos, they were clearly in a group when they died. They even noted that the shells are all facing the same direction, which means that whatever had killed them happened in a flash as they didn't scurry away or attempt to fight off what was coming. Finding one fossil shell like this may be impressive, but finding four right next to each other? That's a different thing entirely. And while it is a little shocking, it is fair to say that scientists were thrilled to have gotten a discovery handed to them like this. Trust me, it's rarely that easy to find such a grouping of ice-aged creatures. Number 16. Space Debris Think about the title of that one for a moment, Space Debris. 
that doesn't really give you too much of a picture about what may or may not be contained in this entry. After all, space debris can mean a great and many things to many different people. Not to mention the kind of space debris that was found on a farm can greatly determine the impact, destruction, or even the importance of it. Now I'll stop beating around the bush. In late 2022, three large chunks of space debris crash landed into Australian sheep farms, and it would be determined to be from SpaceX. Elon Musk caused a terrifying scene once again, but this time it was with his space agency. Specifically, these parts were from a Dragon spacecraft that were taken off of the craft during re-entry. And lest you think that I'm only telling you this because of Elon Musk, you would be wrong. One of those three pieces of debris was a spiked shaped entity that was 10 feet in height and dug into the ground after it hit. So if it had struck a person, they would have died. The irony of this was after the farmer found the space debris, he then called the authorities and they told him to call NASA, which is an odd thing to do because NASA and SpaceX are not the same thing as Elon Musk's company is run by him. Anyways, the look of the debris was so charred at times that it would be rather simple to think that something else had struck the ground, but thankfully no one was hurt by it. Still though, it makes you a little more concerned about what Elon Musk will do with his rocket ships so that they don't break apart and go into somebody's land. Number 15. The Terracotta Army the Terracotta Army is arguably one of the greatest finds in history of archaeology, and yes, it would be rediscovered by a farmer. What are the odds? Now, if you don't know about these statues, they were created to honor and protect the first true emperor of China after it was united under one ruler. The 8,000-plus army was meant to help the emperor in the afterlife should he need protection, and the amount of work that would have went into this has astonished archaeologists for years, and the fact that a farmer came across it on his land while trying to make it better suited for water is mind-blowing. That meant that the tomb that these statues were put in was sealed, and then the land enveloped that tomb so that it wouldn't be found for many, many years later. We're still researching this tomb and the statues within because of how important it is to the Chinese culture, but the sad irony is that despite the farmer finding this incredible piece of history, he was never actually recognized for it. Number 14. Cannabis in New South Wales, Australia, police happened to come across a farm that was growing cannabis. Now, given the world that we live in now where weed is legal in many places, so long as you have the right permits and cards and such, that would not be something to be terrified about, except the amount of cannabis plants that were discovered on this farm was stunning, to the extent that the value of the plants, based on prices at that time, would have been around $70 million. That is a whole lot of weed. But the police were not going to let that happen, so they literally burned the plants up until there were no more. And before you go crying about that, you should know that police claimed the plants were being grown in Australia for Asian crime families. That meant that they would have been used for illegal profiteering, and that's something that police simply cannot abide by. That's why you should always grow your cannabis legally, or don't do it at all. As a flamethrower, we'll knock you down to size if you let it. Number 13. Cannonball at one time in military history, along with naval history as well, the cannonball was one of the most devastating items on the battlefield. As science would tell you, force is equal to mass times acceleration. So putting a giant metal ball in an explosive tube and then launching it at an enemy is a guaranteed way to do some damage. But one place you would not expect to find a cannonball is in a tree. A walnut tree that stood nearly 100 feet tall had to be brought down in 2019. It was diseased and riddled with carpenter ants sitting on a property near the historic Independence Square. But as they tried to fell the tree, they would notice that there were things within it that shouldn't be there. It started with chains, which is definitely something you would not expect in a tree. And after they pulled the tree down, they then began to chop it up and as they did so, a Civil War era cannonball came out of the tree. The person who was chopping it up was stunned, and it's not hard to see why. He even labeled the moment the highlight of his life, which is a bit sad when you think about it. The piece would be collected and is now a treasured part of the local area in which it was found. Number 12. Roman Villa 
Something that history has repeatedly shown us is that just because you build something on a piece of land does not mean it's going to be untouched for centuries to come. In the case of one Roman villa, it would be swallowed up by the ground until eventually becoming a farmland. Eventually, as farmers would dig into the land, they then found the villa once more, but that was only the beginning of what they would uncover. As archaeologists came in and began to exhume the villa, they found a beautiful mosaic within the building that was a true work of art, and that says nothing of the rest of the place. The property included a large hall, featuring a bath suite with hot and cold rooms, as well as extensive living spaces. It was thought to have been occupied in the late Roman period, between the 3rd and 4th century AD. So yes, sometimes there are entire buildings buried beneath farms. Who even knew? Number 11. World War II Bomb when you think about World War II, you typically tend to ponder the events that happened in Japan, in Europe, or Asia via Russia and other nations. But there was another battleground that was vital to the war that many people don't think about, and that would be Africa. Even after the war had ended, there were still Allied forces trying to do some good in the region, and that's why there was an unexploded bomb in the farm of one Kenyan. She thought that it was just another one of her plants until she tried to grab it and realized the truth. Thankfully, she would end up being fine, and after calling the proper authorities, was able to get the bomb off of her land and had it safely detonated. That's the standard procedure for bombs such as these, as they can be highly volatile depending on their age. Sadly though, it's hardly the first bomb that's been found in various places all over the world. Not every bomb detonates, and thus it remains until it's found. Or mines will be left behind because they're too much of a chore to dig up. So if you do find one, don't touch it. Get help immediately. Number 10. Python Hearing that there are animals on farms should not be that much of a shock. After all, there are animals above and below the ground that farmers have to deal with all of the time. But when one Thailand group of farmers found themselves dealing with a 12-foot-long python, that became a different story entirely. The python in question was apparently one that had slithered into an opened part of their field and then came out to greet the farmers when they approached it. They reacted quickly and brought in an expert to help so that they could get the snake out of there. The team that arrived were able to corral the snake and get it away from the farmers, but you can bet that this was hardly the surprise that those guys wanted to find and they'll be weary of any holes that they see as a snake may be crawling out of them again. Number 9. A safe. Imagine for a moment that you're a farmer named Kirk Mathis. You're going about your day farming and suddenly you see a giant metal box in one of your fields. You rush to look at it and you realize that it's a safe, one that weighs well over 500 pounds and was clearly dumped there for some unknown purpose. Equally as curious, the safe has a note attached to it and says that if you can open it, you can keep whatever's inside. Yes, because that's not suspicious at all. Mathis honestly did not try to open it because he felt that it served a better purpose to be closed. But what purpose was that? Well, giving people a distraction from life to think about instead of their own problems. My personal feeling is to leave it as a mystery. The safe would eventually be given to a museum where people came to ogle at it and wonder what was inside. Number 8. Copper Weapons you might not think that ancient weapons are something that you would find on the regular on a farm, but as in all things, it's all about timing and placement. In this case, the timing was 2022, and it was very much an accident that it happened at all, mainly because these weapons were over 4,000 years old and made out of copper. That's very different from certain weapons of the time period, and there were not only swords, but also harpoons as well. That time period tracks with other finds that have happened to be made in the area, and it's good to know on their side because it means that they have a large area to search for even more treasures. But who knows what they might find? Hopefully we will find out soon. Number 7. Croatian Goat is there something odd about the Croatian goat species that earns its way onto our list? Well, no, not specifically. However, in 2014, a very rare Croatian goat would be born, and it was something that many people would likely have freaked out about when the news first broke. <laughs> 
That's because this baby Croatian goat was born with eight legs and both reproductive organs on its body. That's not only freaky, but I'm sure that some people thought it was straight out of a horror movie. Thankfully, it's not the case, but sadly, we do know why it happened. In the womb, eggs will often fuse together when they're not fully viable, but in this goat's case, they merged with their underdeveloped sibling and the results are plain to see. So yes, if you're a farmer, I highly doubt that you want to see this on your farm. Number 6. A Buried Car I'm not done with getting weird with items that have been found on farms, or in this case, a house in Los Angeles. Yes, it is Los Angeles, and that's not what you picture as being farm country, but the story is just too good to pass up. Because in Los Angeles in 1978, some kids were digging in the front yard of their home when they accidentally uncovered a Dyno 246 GTS fully buried beneath them. The car itself was stolen just four years prior, and nobody ever found out where it had gone. That's why the video is so shocking, because if it had been dumped somewhere, that would be fine. If it was taken apart and sold for parts, that would be understandable. But to bury it full tilt in front of a house, how is that even possible without anyone having known? Nobody knows, but the children do have a story that they can tell for the rest of their lives. Number 5. A King Cobra I've already showed you one snake story, so how about another one that's even worse? Because in India, on a palm oil farm, it was much more dangerous due to the king cobra that was wandering around. What's more, that king cobra was also 14 feet in length. King cobras are one of the deadliest creatures in the world, and their venom could absolutely take out a human if bitten by one. Oh, yeah. That's not a snake this big. So not surprisingly, the farmers called in the proper authorities and then they removed the king cobra. It may seem like I'm underselling the situation, but make no mistake, you would not want a 14 foot long snake on your farm near you at any point. So them getting rid of it ASAP, that's some pretty good stuff. And neither the people nor the snake were harmed during the event. Number four, a Roman helmet. Here's a find that is terrifying in the result that it got in its end times. A rare Roman cavalry helmet was found by a man using a metal detector in a northern English field, and if you take a look at that helmet, you can see why it's so rare. It's one that fully covers the face, something that Romans only used for certain activities, such as cavalry sporting events. The helmet was in really good condition when it was discovered, and as a result, when it went to auction, it would sell for over $3.6 million. I told you there was a twist here. Due to where it was found, the laws that would have given museums museums the chance to keep the helmet did not apply, so the finder actually got to keep the majority of the money for himself. Number 3. The Hybrid to be fully upfront with you, I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking at, and this entry isn't for the faint of heart given what's being seen. However, in Thailand, a creature was born that appeared to be the hybrid of a crocodile and a buffalo. That might sound like something from an odd science fiction film about a mad scientist who spliced some animals together, but this was a real creature and something that absolutely boggled people's minds when it would be discovered. Now it's true that certain animals of unrelated species can mate and produce babies, but this isn't exactly what people had in mind when they heard of a hybrid. But at this point, I'm really kind of done focusing on this thing. What do you think that it actually is? and how it came to be. Be sure to let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below so we can solve this intense mystery together. Number 2. Rat King have you ever wondered what would happen if certain animals got their tails tied together, how they would react, and what they would do with themselves to try and be free? Well, when it comes to rats, not only does this happen, but sometimes it can happen to about a dozen of them at the same time. This is actually referred to as a rat king, and as you can see here, the rats are never in a good position when this takes place because they need to get out of it, but they can't. Mm -hmm. Some of the rats in this 13 rat bundle were already dead by the time that people came around to help them. The Rat King event is actually a bad omen for some, and those people claim that a plague is imminent when one of them is found. Number 1. Crop Circles of all the things that could be found on a farm or in a field that you own, one of the most terrifying may well be that of a crop circle. 
that's because they're almost always tied to people who either think that aliens are real or are willing to do anything they can to get people talking about and believing in them. The irony of crop circles is that they've caused legitimate alien fear over the years, but since aliens have not yet touched down that we know of, people are fine with dismissing them for the most part. Yet they do keep popping up, and there was even one in France in the year 2020 that had some very specific markings that made people wonder what was going on, and they likely won't stop that wonder anytime soon. That's all from the realms of farms and the sometimes scary things that have been found on them. Were you amazed by some of those things that farmers had found? And would you have been terrified if you were the one to discover those things? Perhaps there's another farm find that would fit perfectly on this list. And perhaps you've discovered something for yourself at one time. Be sure to let me know all about it in the comments section down below. Check out the other cool things that are showing up on the screen. And I will see you next time. I love you.